is brought to you by Abby's Legendary Pizza and Chromeberg Electric. Hello, Central Oregon, and welcome back to the Big Playback Hoops Edition. I'm your host, Dylan Anderman, taking over for the greatest sports reporter to be ever be seen in the Pacific Northwest, Noah Chass. Thank you, Noah, for all you've done. Today, we had some big-time tournament games around Central Oregon. We start at Summit High School with the Oregon Holiday Hoop Fest. The Caldera Wolfpack were the first team up of three other Central Oregon teams at the tournament. The Wolfpack took on the Forest Grove Vikings, one of two 6A, 5A matchups today. Caldera came out hot in the first few minutes. Miles McCumber finds Jack Benson in the corner. Drano, a big time three early. Except the Vikings have their answer. Vikings, good ball movement, and Nolan Hudgens gets free. He knocks down a three. His teammate and Dwelly Bridges decides to follow his lead and bang from downtown. The Vikings with all the momentum. The Vikings go on a tear and go into the locker room up almost 20 points. However, never say never, the Wolfpack fight as a pack and get back into this game. They fed the 6'8 center, William Jensen. He went to work. Caldera ends up missing a three on this next possession. Jensen snags the rebound, probably a seven foot wingspan, and he puts it up and in. Caldera keeping the momentum and staying true to the alpha. He gets the feed again, goes up, and one, get off of me. He's making it look easy. And believe it or not, Caldera climbed all the way back and forced OT. Early in OT, Jacob Burke is open on the wing. Shooter shoot and another three for the Vikings. They take a two-point lead. Caldera needs to answer, looking to answer, and the pack keeps fighting. Miles McCumber with a fake pass. Knocks down a huge deep three. The Wolfpack hold off the Vikings from coming into their territory and win a nail biter. Wolfpack 62, Force Grow 58. The other 6A matchup came from the Bend High Lava Bears. The Lava Bears are looking for their first win and against a 1 in 5 Clackamas team, they just might. However, Clackamas came into this one hungry. Josh Lopez feeds his man down low. He fights through the pressure and puts it in. Ben High's Cash Hattenhauer with the ball. And if your name is Cash, it might as well fall before money because this bucket was priceless. Lopez takes the inbound here. He's driving. It's blocked. Cavs recover. Start to move the ball. They feed number two, Sed Burton. He swim moves, plants, and drains the jumper. What a move. Burton here again. He comes up. Spin move. Throws up the floater straight in the hoop. He turns around and says, I'm like that. Ben High looking for anything to go their way. Cash open on the wing. He misses. However, big time offensive board, and it goes in. Phoenix Dreka, nice bucket there. Lava Bears with the ball again. Avery Ellis finds a cutting cash, and he brings home the money. Nice play for the Lava Bears. Later in the second half, Avery Ellis does it himself this time and hits it from the corner. Three ball. However, this was all Clackamas here today. Kymer Mitchell with a dominating bucket. Then Burton drives. He goes up and is fouled hard. He hits both free throws shortly after. The Cavs keep on going and keep on fighting off the Lava Bears. Saya takes it at the top of the key. Spin move. Goes down low. And one tough bucket for the junior. The Lava Bears stay winless this season. They lose big. Coming up, we have some more Central Oregon hoops action. Don't go anywhere.